Hey, what's up? This is Rob from Panther, and today we're going to mount some text in Photoshop. All right, first step, click on the type tool, type in whatever you want. I'm going to choose the mango font and I'm going to go with the bold like that. Press Ctrl T, press and hold Alt, increase it. I'm going to put it somewhere up here. I'm going to right click on the text, click on rasterize type. I'm going to select the marquee tool and I'm going to select the upper area of the font somewhere here. And I'm going to press Ctrl X, Ctrl V. So this way it's going to cut in two pieces and I'm going to put the bottom side somewhere down and the top part somewhere here. I'm going to select the marquee tool again and I'm going to select a little bit of area from here. Also make sure that uh, you're on the right layer. So this one is the top layer right here, the top text. So I'm also going to drag it up and I'm going to press Ctrl T. I'm going to press and hold Shift if you're in uh, Photoshop 2023 and now you can drag it until they are going to touch. I'm going to double click, release, press Ctrl D to deselect. And I'm going to go to the second layer and I'm going to reposition it. All right, so select both layers, press and hold Shift, right click and click on Merge Layers. And I'm going to go to the Smudge tool and I'm going to start distorting these gently. I think it's enough. Now I'm going to select both the background and the text, right click, convert a smart object. And I'm going to go to filter, blur gallery, field blur, and I'm going to add some more blur. Some of the areas I'm going to add some more blur here, maybe here. I'm going to decrease the blur here. And if you click, it's just going to add these little points, which basically you can customize them. Look at that. Looks pretty badass. I'm going to leave it like this. Click OK. I'm going to go to Filter, Noise, Add Noise. I'm going to go with Monochrome and I'm going to decrease the amount of noise. This looks actually pretty dope. I'm going to go with 869. Click OK. And I'm also going to go to Adjustment Layer. Click on the Gradient Map. Click on the Gradient. Change the color. And you also can click somewhere here to add more color. You can change that up. and finish this is how you make it thanks for watching and if you're new on the channel don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you get notified with daily updates and also check out the rest of the videos at the end have a good one bye bye